yeah. Google estimates 40,000 single men in Chicago in your demographic. So you gotta click with at least one of them. Mm. Yeah. Maybe. What up, y'all? This is your boy Ace here, and welcome to After News. Like, let's talk about Hannah, man. Uh, I did about, I think up until this point, four videos. So definitely check out my other mayor videos from this week. I talked about Dr. Zola Mod in two videos, and I also talked about Sharon Goodwin's situation in two videos as well. Wanted to just touch up on uh, Hannah, right? So, um, so Hannah's uh, date or whatever, he came up there, he had thyroid, right? And, uh, and, it's still, I don't know if she's still dating this dude or not, but like he came up there to get get check, get that checked out. But and towards the end of the episode, she was talking to uh, one of the other doctors. Um, I forgot her name. Um, uh, one of the, uh, I think she's new to the, um, I think she's new though. But she was talking to her kind of like just a you know girl girly type thing, and. She was revealing some information to her that Dr. Zola Ma had found earlier when they were at the cafeteria. And Zola actually found like something about Neanderthals or something like there's still men out here who are like still Neanderthals or something like that. It was some type of study she found. And she brought it over to uh, the other doctor. And so, and she presented that information to Hannah. And Hannah was like, no way. You know, she was surprised about that. And so, but. Her friend was telling her, like, you know, there is, like, 40,000 other single men in Chicago that you can, that's in her demographic that she can date. And then that's when they show Ripley, which was kind of surprising. Like, they show Ripley, like, walking by, and she kind of looked, like, you know, it, like, she had to think about it for a second. You know, like, maybe Ripley could be one of them, you know what I'm saying? So, we didn't really see, like, Ripley helped her out with the thyroid thing. You know, check out, check them out. But we didn't really see like the interaction we saw last week between those two. So I'm thinking like when we see these two in the future, you know, we're probably going to see some some evolving uh, signs that they will be together, man. Because there's no doubt about it. The way they're the way they're giving us hints and stuff like that. There's no doubt about it. Hannah's going to be with this dude, bro. Like you pretty much at this point, you pretty much know that's the case, right? Like you know, so. <laughs> Like, you pretty much know at this point, like, we're going to see these two together. So, I don't think it's going to shock any of us if they put them together. So, um, but yeah, man, it, it was very interesting. Very interesting stuff going on here, man. But uh, give me your thoughts on this, man. I want to thank y'all for watching Med these first four weeks of the season, man. Uh, been happy to be, be back covering Chicago Med, man. We're going to get a little break next week, and then we'll be back the week after that, man. So, I'll see y'all then. I love y'all, man. Thank y'all for watching this one. After news, so like I'm about to get to Chicago Fire right now.